Hunter Ferguson. Ah, wouldn't let me wouldn't let me name it turd. I don't know why. It's not that bad. We named our ship and I thought we'd do a Nexus mission. They're quite fun and they give you access to the colored suns, the green, the blue, the red and stuff. Before you have the right drive. It was kind of a little cheat. Uh, please let me know in the comments if you like in the series. I know the tutorial was hideous, but they should get better now because I can freewheel it. And that's what these games are really all about. And it's a, one thing I can say is it's a good tutorial to teach you the game. So just follow it to this point at least. Because then when you go into your, not tab, escape, you've got we've got all three main stories open. And we got our base going yet. We got some side missions. So we're fine. And if I do keep doing it, even if I slow down on it, because I'm definitely going to keep playing the game, I'm just going to make our way to the center of the galaxy. I haven't finished any of the main stories, so. I don't know how long these missions stay up here. Quicksilver mission. But let's check out, and I'll show you what you can actually get with the Quicksilver. A lot of it's just cosmetic stuff. But just cool stuff, base decorations, different avatars, stuff like that. I did do one, a lot of it's, this is stuff for your... You can get lizard heads. Fireworks. What's that thing? Ah, here we go. Warp Core Jenner Rescue Stranded Life Form. So let's do mission info. I'm signed up. Other people can't do. Specialist Polo, even more emotional than usual, implores travelers to answer a distress signal they have reaped. Unable to leave the anomaly of themselves, Polo is relying on the courage of their friends. The mission is to rescue a long lost contact. The starship seems to have met an unfortunate fate. We're Piper Core? Whoa. Alright, let's do it. That seems good. I've never did it. Yeah, sure. Uh, it might not be on a planet. I wanted to do a planet. Anyways, I can explain it to you. If you go to one that's on another planet, you can get some of the rare resources at the very beginning from the colored suns. You know, it might send you to a green sun. I got Emerald. That's how I kind of discovered the trick. I think it's kind of well known. I thought I saw a video with the title that might mean this. But you can get the cadmium and stuff and give you a little jump start. Just make sure to hype or harvest a bunch more than you need. And then you can bring it out of there, sell it, and just make your drive. Alright. Let's head in and see what we got. doing down there I'm sure he's happier to see us sounds like he's been here a while I hear a sharp intake of breath from the traveler they begin to reach towards me then pause as though thinking better of it and the spirit traveler Mortland shows me the ship's shattered communicator controlling unit. This part is far beyond repair. It could be potentially be replaced. Salvage a working component. Huh? So let's go land up here. And look for salvage containers. Oh, what's that? You got 
got some good stuff we can get right there. We'll park up here. We won't use any. We won't need any launch through fuel for this. We're gonna get it and then work our way back. item found Sh ship communicator control so that was easy now we can just try to get some loot there's a ship is that way so Not a big one. these little ones are giving me some uranium those can be used for fuel salvage data. Ooh, let's go get that. That's the one we've seen flying in. We got some veg up here. It's the wheat. Let's snag it. Ooh, two of them. Ah, this would be a good one here. I don't have to worry about uranium for a little bit. capturing him. Let's 
milk him. Oh, he's searching. Leave him alone. him Put a little cargo drum on him no nah, he's so cute got going on in here. These can be good sometimes. Could buy that. I think we get it though. Let's do it anyway. Because maybe we'll get something else. I think that might be how it works. Where's your trade post, buddy? Some of these now you can get some money on. See, that's negative 31 instability injector. Should we go for it? Let's do it. 581,000. I'm just going to see 581, and we'll see what that sells for. What do we got on the ship? Shit, no. Let's do it. 581,000 for that. I've noticed you can do that on some of them. You get them deep discounts. They must make that stuff here or whatever. All right, let's get back to that guy. We had a nice little haul here. Let's see about fueling up our ship first. Ooh, I think we might get a warp core for this. That'd be nice. Launch thruster, seek uranium. Ah. Ah, I see. All right. An analyze this. Encryption terminal located. Ooh, what are these? I have not seen these before. Oh, these are nav data. Oh, this thing does.
does drive like crap. Dangerous landing path. Active, phase present, compatible device. Key downloaded, syncing, device decrypted. Traveler Molten. I hear a sharp intake of breath from the traveler, then begin to reach towards me, then pause as though thinking better. Give heart. Holy cow, you took off quick. Life form rescued. Return to Nexus. Let's do it. I gotta summon it. Well, let's do this then. Let's shoot over to the... Let's shoot over to the space station, call in the anomaly, and we can get some buffs on our gear. On our backpack. Perfect. Because you can get one at the anomaly in every... in everything, so we'll land here close to the space station we'll call in the anomaly we'll hit the space station then go to the anomaly i want to sell that stuff so we 581k instability So 700, so we made 120 and they're still negative 17. So I bet you in a different system you'd get more, but anyways, I'm getting it. Let's clear some inventory up. What do we got for cash now? 880. 
Yeah, let's get to the anomaly. Woo! This thing is unwieldy, to say the least. I did it, Nada. Complete mission. Quicksilver and a warp hypercore. Let's see if we can get anything that we might need. I like that figurine for inside my ship. That'd be cool. Look at this one. Oh. Ooh. Rock garden? That's pretty cool. I'm just gonna chill. We'll hold it. So we get a we gotta find a better base. There's one of the living ships. I'd like to get that too. But anyways, let's go take care of this, get all our stuff that we can and get out of here. Hey brother. This guy wants your data, your discovery data on something different all the time. Give data, creature data. Hundred forty. This guy wants my milestones. Milestone data. Another hundred and fifty there. Nada. All right, everybody, that should do it. But that's kind of it. Nexus missions, and you can get them on both my other ones. One that's really nice to do by yourself is there's a mission where you have to eliminate hazardous plants. That one's real good because you just cruise around killing all the Venus flytraps and stuff, and you get a lot of minerals, explore the planet, so you get all that nanites. Uh, by yourself, limited time, that's always a good day well spent, it seems like. You can get a lot of your stuff you need, you get some quicksilver, and you usually get one other thing. Oh, let's check this out. Where's that hypercore? Oh, that completely filled my hypercore, so we will be ready to start heading to the center of the universe next show. We'll go burn up like half of our stuff, half of that fuel, and then we'll call in and see what happens. But, all right, everybody, have a good one. I'll probably be going to stay here and do a couple more missions over the next day before I re uh, record some more. And just set us up so we can have a big travel episode and see if we can find anything cool. All right.